Delta Plus variant uh, is now seen in uh, more than 10 states. And uh, we have seen that uh, younger patients and those who are not vaccinated, they are mainly affected by this Delta Plus variant, which is the um, big concern for all of us. And uh, most of these patients have the atypical presentations. Some of these patients don't have classical symptoms like breathlessness, cough, rather they have the uh, diarrhea, headache, or skin rashes. So uh, diagnosis is also uh, confirmed by uh, gene sequencing. And uh, most of these patients are young, and uh, they remain uh, undiagnosed sometimes. We don't know which stain is causing the problem, but once we have uh, detected these stains in different states, then now we are uh, more uh, worried about these uh, new cases. And we need uh, more uh, efforts to vaccinate most of the population. Sizes Kerala may soon be available for the 12 to 18 age group. Uh, yes, it is a very good step. Most of the countries have already started vaccination in the children uh, between 12 to 18. And India has already started uh, the research trials. Uh, most of the centers are doing uh, studies. One study is going on in All India Institute of Medical Sciences and many more center, multi-centric trials are already going on. And uh, these groups uh, need uh, vaccination also because we have seen that uh, third wave uh, if it comes at all, uh, the more children should be affected because vaccination is already on above the age of 18, but this uh, less than 18 is still uh, unvaccinated. It is very good step that uh, if we have all the data and if vaccination is done in the less than 18 group also, it is a very big step for uh, Indian uh, scientists and Indian doctors who have done the great proud for the nation. Well, the Delta variant compared to, for example, the original virus that had been circulating very early on last year, the comparison is that it is transmitted much more efficiently, which means the chances of getting infected upon exposure is greater to the dominant variant that we have now in the United States. Anyone who is not vaccinated is most at risk. Younger people are less likely to be vaccinated that puts the entire cohort of younger people at greater risk based on the data that this virus transmits more easily and can be more dangerous has been the underlying reason why they've made that change and upgraded it, as it were, to a variant of concern. The vaccines are over 90% effective, as much as 93, 94, 95% effective. So it's really good against getting infected and getting sick at all. And it's very good against protecting you against severe disease that might result in hospitalization. If you like this video, share it and subscribe to Business Standard. For more news, views and insights, log on to www.business-standard.com.